black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. All right, so today we walk a brave new path at Burger King. Inside this bag are all menu items that I have never tried from Burger King. I'm switching up the whole thing. I'm usually a Whopper guy. I don't like the cheese here, things like that, but we're going crazy today. We're going fully off the reservation and uh, we're finding ourselves in some different items. So that is hefty and smelling delicious. Second burger, another one. What's that gonna be? Who knows? We don't know. Another little mystery. Never seen those before. Never had those before. Those are a featured new item. And these, of course, we have seen before. Those are standard. Let's just not kid ourselves here, okay? Okay, so first things first, while they're hot and ready to trot, this is called a cheesy tot. Hot, really hot. Basically like a, almost like a mac and cheese bite. But there's no mac inside really. It's just a cheesy, almost mashed potato, like thin. They're good. I can definitely get on board for them. Especially with their level of heat, of warmth. I appreciate that. That they're actually pretty piping. Mm. See? Mashed potato. Coke Zero. Palette cleanser. Real nice for my mild hangover right now. But here we go. So my last Whopper video, I was going through the drive-thru and I was searching for this burger and I thought for sure they had it. And that is the Big King XL. So like the Big Mac, but Burger King edition. It's weird, they don't show it on their menu, but when I asked, he says they have it. So, that, uh, that was certainly strange. All right, so there we go. Two patties, cheese, special sauce, the fixings inside, pickle, onion, all the goods. This is a whole new territory for me. It has gonna be an oniony bite right up front too. A whole stack there. I'm very intrigued to know what their Big Mac sauce is gonna taste like. Let us go in everywhere. Whoa. All right. Okay. Loki. I might have been sleeping on BK with these other burgers. But that's pretty good. And by pretty good, I mean, damn. <laughs> I'm officially converted. 
the cheese is not offending me in this burger. It is actually delicious, creamy and delicious. Their uh, Big Mac sauce is definitely different, obviously, than McDonald's. But overall, it's delicious. I would say it's a bit sweeter. I find uh, McDonald's Big Mac sauce to have a little more tang to it. Obviously because of the flame broiled patty nature of this burger. It's much different than a Big Mac. Definitely a different flavor prof profile than a Big Mac for sure. but delicious nonetheless. It's got its own unique vibe. Also, that's a lot more meat. I would be willing to bet that two Burger King pad, or Two McDonald's patties. In the Big Mac. Probably doesn't even add up to a single Burger King patty. Now this one is for a subscriber who's been asking for a long time, saying I need you to try that spicy chicken sandwich from Burger King. Now I've had the regular crispy chicken, but I've never had the spicy. So this is for you, my boy. I think you're a boy, if not my girl, or whatever your pronoun is. But I hope you're watching this. Okay. Yeah, there's some heat on that. Nice amount of mayo. The heatness level makes me wish. I requested some extra lettuce or extra veggies. Nice and crunchy. to kind of combat the heat because it is quite spicy. Mm -hmm. Definitely delicious. I can get on board for all of that. Absolutely. Speed racer and the rice burner. So comparatively, we actually the Tim Hortons I got 
all that food was $23. This meal, same price, 23 bucks for two burgers. Fries, a drink, and some tots. I wonder how that stacks up. I mean, that burger, like Big King XL is like, that's a lot of food. It's a hefty burger. Either way though, both of them were delicious. I was actually craving this because there's a girl, I've mentioned her in the past before, Yummy Lou. She disappeared for seven months and then returned recently with a Burger King video. And one of her old Burger King videos was like one of my favorite videos ever. So I saw that she had returned and she was just mashing on some Burger King burgers. And I was like, I gotta get that King XL. I, bet I gotta try that. Yeah, I didn't really care for fries. Wasn't my jam. Don't really care about them. They're cold and not that great. One of these for dessert. And we'll call that a video. I hope those burger segments were cravey vibes for you. I would say I'm definitely going to be getting probably that King XL in the future again. It's good. I, uh, I have to bite my tongue on that. I have to eat my words, if you will, because I was kind of hating on on the idea of it, but it was good. So, until the next one, you know what to do, eat good, live well, stay true.